guys, I'm gonna do another tag video and this one is the get to know me tag. So the first question is, are you named after anyone? Well, yes, I'm actually named after Cindy Lauper and Cindy Crawford. Um, for some reason my mom just knew I would be a crazy kind of girl and guess what? I am. <laughs> my mom was, um, she was very young in the 80s, uh, she was in her 20s in the 80s and it was her favorite era and Cindy Lauper also happened to be her favorite singer. So I am named after Cindy Lauper but just written differently. So, yes. Question number two. When was the last time you cried? I cried quite badly with the seasoning opening on The Walking Dead, so season seven, when two people died and I really cried as if my heart was getting broken by a boyfriend or so, even though I am single at this moment. So I went through that quite a lot. But I still it felt like someone was just taking my heart out and throwing all over the floor and it felt so fucking shitty. <laughs> so yeah. So question number three, do you have kids? Um no I don't have kids. I am infertile and I probably don't want kids either. Question number four. If you were another person, would you be a friend of yourself? Probably. I, I quite like myself. I have my errors and um, sometimes I can be really weird, but overall I like who I am as a person. I love myself, so I think I would be a friend of myself, yes. And question number five. Do you use sarcasm a lot? Sometimes. Just sometimes. If someone is being really stupid, I just don't use sarcasm, yes. So, question number five. Will you ever bungee jump? I actually bungee jumped quite a lot of times already by now. When I was a kid, um, almost 10 years ago as well. And I just really like the brush it gives you. Um, so yeah, I think my next thing on my bucket list is a free fall or jumping from a mountain or paragliding or stuff like this. So I'm quite a daredevil, so I really like this stuff. Question number seven. What is your favorite cereal? Uh, anything with chocolate? Um, I like Krispies or Honey Pops or Smacks. Smacks. <laughs> or mostly stuff like this. Question number eight. What is the first thing you notice about people? Um, like I said in the previous one, their eyes, since I like to talk to people and of course I like to talk to people. <sighs> Dur. <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, I tend to look at people's eyes when I'm talking to someone since it is a sign of respect and that is always the first thing I notice. So the eye color of someone is what I notice first. Then question number nine, what is your eye color? Um, I have kind of um, interesting eye color. I don't know if you can tell, but it's kind of blue and gray and green and brown. Um, I'm really up close in my camera now. <laughs> it's so hard to look like directly into my camera. It's like gonna eat away my soul or something. So yeah, this is my eye color. Um, okay, question number 10. Scary movie or happy endings? Definitely a scary movie. Um, I like horror movies, which is not a big secret. So yeah, I like to get scared. I like my adrenaline going through my veins and everything. So definitely a scary movie. Question number 11. Favorite smell? Smell. No, just kidding. Smell when you're walking in the forest and you, you're like just right now it's fall and when you're walking that, I just really like the smell of death leaves. Death leaves are. I really, I really do like fall and that's. I like fall. That's just it. <laughs> so yeah. Question number 12. Summer or winter? Um, both have their charms in... Hmm. Hard question. 
I think I would say winter because I'm born in the winter. Really like winter because it's cozy. You get to pick up snowballs and throw it at someone. Um, it's it's just a very cozy period. Period. Definitely. <laughs> yes. So question number thirteen: computer or television? Um, honestly, computer because television is just a bunch of crap. You can watch anything you want on your computer and on the television they just throw everything into your face what they want you to see and they hide what you don't want to see and basically on a computer you can do the research you want for yourself so definitely a computer since you're not getting so much brainwashed by society yeah that would be my answer question number 14 what is the furthest to have ever been from home? Mm, I, I think Hungary because I went to a festival called Siget um, I think two years, three years? Two years ago now I think and Hungary, so in Budapest uh, that was quite a far away and the past two years I've been to Slovenia which is less far from Hungary Question 15. Do you have any special talents? Uh, I sense people's energy and that is not a joke. I generally feel people's energy when they're around me. I can tell if they're good people, well, good people or bad people, if they have good intentions or bad intentions for me. And yeah, I would say I am very much in touch with my third eye. Um, hence, I am spiritual. I am a very, very, very spiritual person. I am also pagan and I will do an in-depth video about this. It is not a religion to me. So, um, yeah, it's just a choice that I made for myself and I feel very comfortable with that. I've always been quite very spiritual since I was a little child. Yeah, so question number 16. Where were you born? I was born in Belgium in this place called Anderlecht. Um, yes, <laughs> Anderlecht sucks. I, I like the football kind of thing, but I don't like the place. Anderlecht sucks. So, question number 17. What are your hobbies? Obviously, YouTubing, reading, uh, going to concerts, meeting up with friends, um, going to punk shows, um, writing poetry, reading poetry, watching movies, um, creating art, uh, DIYing, all that good stuff. So, yes. Question 18. Do you have any pets? Well, yes, I have a doggy, um, which you've probably seen on Instagram a lot. Um, if you didn't, I will put pictures. And I even have a tattoo of my doggy. So, question number 19. Favorite movie? Mm, that's a hard one, actually, because my favorites tend to change all over time. And I'd say right now, my favorite movie is... Well, the last one I saw was Crybaby, and I really like Crybaby, since it's with Johnny Depp, and it's way more underrated than Grease, because Grease is far too overrated, and way too common, and way too known, but honestly, I really like uh, Crybaby, since it has a lot of elements of uh, Elvis Presley in it, any kind of movie with Johnny Depp and Tim Burton, so, yes. Hmm, I also, hmm, wow, wow, what was that? I don't know. And I also really like Sweeney Todd. Question number 20, do you have any siblings? Nope, I'm just alone. Woohoo! Question number 21, what do you want to be when you grow up? I'm almost 25, I think I'm grown up now. But what I wanted to be when I wanted to grow up when I was 13, I wanted to be a professional dancer since I used to dance in um, for like five years and I was pretty good um, and I always wanted to become a dancer I never wanted to dwell on my mm, knowledge that's a, a way to put it um, but I couldn't 
So um, then what I wanted to be was a teacher, um, English and um, history. But it changed as well and um, just, you know, my eating disorder took over and right now, what I want to be now, as a grown-up, I want to be happy. Simple as that. I just want to be happy with myself. I am happy with myself. I love myself. I generally do love myself. And I want to be happy with someone. Um, someone I can call my partner. And preferably on a long term. Um, I see myself marrying in the future without kids. But I definitely see myself marrying with one certain person and just being happy, giving this person all of my love and I just want to be happy, genuinely happy. Um, hope you liked this video guys, if you did, like it and of course subscribe, don't that one subscribe, subscribe <laughs> anyways, um, bye bye guys.